Welcome to Bottom Line Sports Talk. I'm George Abraham. You know my partner, Albert Cameron. Yeah. Just a little McLaughlin. I, I figured he's going somewhere. And, and from what he did in college, uh, he's going to get And I like the fact that by being a free agent, you can go where they want you. I think in the old days when they had way more rounds, you just kind of got stuck. I think this is an opportunity. Art, George is a really good friend, and I get to know him too. Our, I, we have an agent friend that says, free agents make it. See, we, in, the, in, yeah. in the old days, they didn't make so. it. The salary, the salary in the NFL, they pay their quarterbacks so much. And there's an example. Russell Wilson getting paid at Denver all that money. Mm -hmm. uh, if he can play special teams at all, return kicks, whatever, and uh, yeah. he has a chance to make it, George. You're good right. Point. No, that's another thing. The special teams, I, you know, just like the other day, we we're friend, we we're a fans of Swifty. The uh -huh. run. Well, I found out he only makes a million and a half. Well, no wonder they want him. Uh -huh. He and the other guy there make less than the kid at Philly Miles from Sanders. Woodland Hill Mouse that uh -huh. went. So their salary combined. So it is economic. I didn't know Swift made that last too my, my, that much either. No, didn't make it all. Five. That's what I'm saying. It's amazing. Yeah. yeah. Wow, think as a high draft more. choice, too, yeah, second round. Yeah, you think he'd have made more. He and the guy that they have, Gainwell. Uh -huh, they yeah. are making less than Miles Sanders. Gotcha. And Gainwell, by the end of the year, was the guy. Yeah, he was. He was pretty They know he can't count on him every day. But, yeah. but, a, but I was, uh, uh, it's interesting because Jaleel McLaughlin is so good. Well, and I just, I'd like to sit down and, and with the scouts or whatever and find out what does he lack. That he didn't get drafted. I mean, that's it how good. That's how good you have to be in the NFL. It might be a tick. Yeah. Liter no, literally, a tenth or something. And then let's let's. They make mistakes too. Make many mistakes. Yeah. I've I, but I, would, I just want to hear him say why. Yeah. In like other words, maybe he can't pass block. Maybe yeah. he can't. I don't know what the reason would be. Yeah. Because I because anybody in Youngstown knows. Oh. He's been the best back they've seen that no. come come through. Yeah. Here. We we were told about him years ago. Mm -hmm. Somebody said. Wait till you see it. And then I'm looking. See, I didn't realize. Yeah, he came from Notre Dame College and transferred I in. I didn't yes. realize the numbers. My gosh, his numbers. But as you say, what they're looking for, they might just, and they may miss him. They this do. This is his chance. They do. We also have another YSU kid, that center Mike McAllister, who's getting an opportunity with the Rams. Uh, once you get into camp, um, yeah. you're going to have to really shine as a free agent, no question about it. And you're going to have to help for an injury or two that lets you play a little yeah. more in exhibition games. And, uh, but he did make his name. And we always wonder, why do you have pro days and why do you have, why do you have go to those combines? He was not thought of as that. He was a second team all conference. It wasn't like he was. Yeah. But he went there and got 24, 24 reps on the bench and ran the fastest time every of center. every center. Yeah. Do you understand though, those... <laughs> Those metrics, whatever you call them, George, they catch their eye. Absolutely. You know, how many reps. Don't think they offense. don't know where he is right now. Oh, yeah. That's, you know, they, they, that catches their eye. And, tenth fastest. Mm -hmm. That is impressive. And top ten of every offensive lineman who went there, that tells you enough. He can play multiple positions and, and continues where he's going, you never know. So we have two YSU guys. We'll, we'll keep an eye on them and see how, how they do. Good luck to any Penguins that try, get tryouts in all sports. Mm. We have YSU sophomore also, uh, Alexa Randonovic, holds a record in both the 100 and 200 butterfly and swimming. She was injured but came bounced back and took the, took the rising title in the 200 fly. Oh, is it? Is it really? Yeah. It looked I'm like a, a great, I thought it was a girl. No, 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 no. That might be my, no, maybe my, my greatest line. Freshman season. No, because I thought... you got to be laughing on the on camera now. No, no, but I'm saying... It, it, it I heard sounds, the name Alexa. <laughs> no. Yeah, but I, I believe it's a uh, Eastern European name, and it's a guy. I love it. It's because it does say his freshman. Yeah. It does say his freshman yeah. year on my paper. Thank you for that, George. But uh, Alexa, my apology, but still congratulations for winning the 200 fly. Phantoms won their first, first game of the playoffs. Uh, as we do this show, they had played another game. with hasn't come up yet. But congratulations on overtime goal. There's a lot of overtime goals, George, yeah. playing in the NHL yeah. and now yeah. also in, in the Phantoms. Yeah, that, uh, that hockey, a lot of tie scores, yes. a lot of one goal. A lot of parity. You know, well, what do you have to say more than Boston? You know, when I looked, 
We don't do as much hockey. We do it now and again. Uh-huh. But let's say this while we're here. There have been 10 times that the team with the most wins didn't win. But listen to this. Eight of them, they got knocked out in the first round. Wow. Once second round, once in the final. Wow. So this wasn't Boston. No Luke, fluke, huh? It, you always say get no in. No fluke. You always say get in. Oh, yeah. NBA and NHL, I, have, I truly believe that. That if you get in, you have a chance. Well, it used to be in the old days. There was this myth you couldn't win yeah, in a row right, in the NBA. Right. It's long gone. Yeah, no, yep. You couldn't say it any better, It's George. long gone. So, yep. yeah, let's talk about it. Um, Chalker, you know, what? Eight, eight games eight in, a row. in a row. Pretty sweet, George. 11 oh, nothing victory over Lordstown. Yep. That's Abby Grimm, homer to triple. Gabriella Neves, Neves, pair of doubles. Uh, when you go on an eight-game winning streak, that means you're getting play, um, play from the pitching, no question, softball. Yeah, I get that. But also different hitters coming through. And, and uh, uh, Tatum Hudak is the pitcher. She struck out 11 and pitched a two-hitter in five innings. Congratulations uh, to the Chalker team. Also, congratulations to the Columbiana softball team. Uh, Mackenzie Gamble, uh, what, a, what a week she had. Uh, <laughs> no runners, 57. 50 <laughs> She retired. I'm doing 50. threes. I'm in my head doing threes. That's two and a half games. Fifty-seven straight runners not, did not make get to the, they don't get on base. Not um, a good sign if you're the other. <laughs> they claimed the EOAC title at fifteen and two. Um, they've been knocked out in tournaments the last couple of years, and, and and we are knowing that uh, Coach Kurtz is saying, "Listen, it's, well, with her it's, on the what do you call it? They don't call it a mound. With her on the rubber, there, I got her chances. Yes, that's what they're hoping oh my for. Gosh, fifty. I'm doing the math three hundred million. That's only almost three games. <laughs> yes. I mean, I like my chances too. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Let's get a run on the board and make that other team, you know, feel really desperate. Right. That's impressive. Yeah. When you get to the playoffs and you have a pitcher like that and you fill yeah. the ball, fill the fill the softball. Yeah. You have a chance to win some games, and we'll follow we'll follow Columbiana you know, as they move into the playoffs. I time. watch a lot of college softball on TV, a lot, and I am more amazed every time I watch it. I would say in this area, the speed. The arms on the infielders, my goodness, can they get that ball over there? Yeah, I, 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 I don't know what George was going to say. That, that is my number one thing I'm impressed with also, that you got, you got players behind the pitcher that not only field it cleanly, but throw it like a Major League Baseball player. That ball, that ball was zipped over quickly, yeah. out of the glove, and from the infield up to the first to first base across the infield, it's pretty amazing how they do it. Hey, I have Those are great thing, players. Another thing I've been watching now, uh, some Major League Baseball. And, you know, for we're ancient as far as, right. you know, choking up and, hit, you know, yeah, not no, striking no, never out and all this nonsense. Yeah. But, but my point is this. I see more guys in the infield backing up on balls and booting them then trying to go for the make for the hop, huh? I think you know, and the fact that it's pretty much all artificial or whatever. I wonder if it has anything to do with it. We were taught to go get the ball, you know, charge the ball. Yeah, yeah, get the beat, beat, get the good hop. I'm yes. not seeing that, Al. That's interesting because that's, that's it looks that's, like the ball's playing them. Yeah, that's the worst thing you can do in an infield. Oh boy. Okay, yep. let's talk NBA. Final four's in. Let's talk a little bit about the East first. You got Philly, Boston. Now, I know the Sixers have a nice team, and I'm a big fan of a couple of their guys, but I like Maxi. Uh, he's a good player. But you better have the big boy in B. Yeah. I, I mean, impossibility. I'll, I'll call that right now. It, it, Is it four? Yeah. For a seven-game seven series, George, there's no chance. for if it, be, if it be doesn't play, for Boston not to win it. No, not. No, I agree. No. Can they win a game? Well, that's what I'm saying. There's no you chance. You don't think even a game. I don't, no, they can, maybe, they can win a game. Okay. No, they can win a game. All right. But not a series. I'm saying that he has to play. Uh, what are you hearing about him, George? I'm uh, hearing a lot. The lines, he was shooting around this morning. Okay, so he might play. He, I saw him yesterday, definitely shooting around, but he wasn't game shooting. Okay. He was pose, he was shot in, I hate, pose okay. shooting. He yeah. can do that. <laughs> he can do that all he wants. He's not playing that game. There's going to be somebody on him. But my point is, that line has hung around 10 as if they're afraid that he might and don't want to make it seven, but are afraid if he doesn't, it should be 12. And they, they've just kind of left it at 10. Well, I saw it at six and a half yesterday. Yeah, it's 10. And it went, no, that's why I think he's not playing. I agree. No. It was, it went that from, makes sense. It went from six and a half to 10. I saw 10. Yeah. Nine yeah. and a half was last I saw. And I'm figuring he's so not he's playing. So he's not playing. 
He's not playing. Six and a half to ten, he's not playing. You know what the thing is? I know I'm going to – I got into it with one of his supporters. I was talking. I said, <laughs> I'm sorry. I said, I can't. Because every time I turn around, there's a girl pushing his knee back behind his head, laying behind the bench. <laughs> now, I'm, he goes, oh, freak misses more. How's the freak team? They're going too. Well, they all miss. So, so that Jeez. argument, that argument's out. It doesn't, you can't name uh, them. You cannot name many players that that don't don't miss. So we do agree and beat short series if he's out. Yes, I agree. Now the Sixers they beat the Nets, but uh, this will be different. the Nets. <laughs> I mean, I honest to God, I told. I mean, Albert, but, you know, but this, don't the Celtics and Nets are yeah. white night and day. I told Albert. I said I got to tell you, I, I watched a lot of ball, and I watched the Nets. And I watch them miss shots. Now, I know everyone misses. I'd be foolish, but not the way they miss them. A foot and a half right, a foot and a half left, under the basket, shot clock going off. And they were in those games. They were. They were in those. That's, That's why I'm leery of Philly. Oh, I don't think Philly has a chance to get the boss without They were in that game. Now, if he plays, you can beat, they, they can beat anybody. Yeah. Because that's how good a player he is. Absolutely. Now, the Knicks-Miami game one is big. There is a stat out there. If you lose game one at home, I not mean, much it, chance. You're it's, right. It's it's pretty. I would good. not give the next. I tell you chance. what, I would have done the other night though. I was going to tell you, if I I because I if when I saw Phoenix last game one, which we'll talk about in a minute, right. I was going to get a hold of you and tell you bet Phoenix now. At plus I knew you like feeling Phoenix in the series. You well, said well, that. Well, I but I don't know. I like Yoki. So and this Murray appears to be healthy. Well, he is healthy. He's, he's a load. You're gonna put thirty four points up well, on him. load. Yeah, but let's talk. But that would be your bet. You should have gone yeah, over that one because you like Phoenix. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, game one, Miami. You know, in the Garden, you're looking. Next thing you know, now they have the home court. Jimmy Butler tweaked an ankle, but knowing him, he'll be out He's there fine. next game. He's, He's fine. pretty tough. But that's not an upset to me at all. Not not at all. The Knicks, Miami. You know what I'm saying? Four like, five. They beat the. They're no, five. Saying, yeah. They beat the four. Yeah. This is an eight. But I'm. When did you see an eight? You don't think Miami's as good as the Knicks? Well, oh, I think they are. they are. I think they are. But, I, mean, I, I don't care I mean, what seating it was. Eight. But I don't consider, once again, I knew how I feel about this. I don't think, I don't I, agree. M- Miami's not an eight. <laughs> well, when they're healthy, they're not an That's eight. That's what I'm saying. And they don't have They didn't play all no, year. They don't have out of Bayou and they don't have Hero. I know, but I'm saying all year, Miami didn't really, just get, get they just wanted to get in the so playoffs. They're in, they're in. They're in. in. But, I'm not, but the Knicks aren't that good, I'm saying. Yeah. What are, you know, is Cleveland, that, Cleveland made it too easy Cle- for them. Cleveland's no good. That's they, all. They, they, not ready they, yet. they had a decent year, though. They, but, I, but I'm saying. Did you hear the, this, guy? The, George and I are way off on this the one. The four should I don't not, follow the see, regular season I know you don't follow. That's what I'm saying. The four <laughs> should not lose to the five in five games. If things are normal. Oh, I agree with that. Yeah, I mean, they gave it but to But Cleveland's them. no good. <laughs> well, they're not, I wouldn't say that. I would. That's not fair. They're, they're better. They're not no good. I mean, from to win a championship, well, no, they're Cleveland's not, champion. not even a chance. No. There's not a chance Cleveland's winning a but championship. But what I'm saying, four, and there's not a chance the Knicks are winning a championship. But I'm saying four or five shouldn't be four games. I agree with that. And they just, I can't explain it. And you know, dog, but you think Miami came into this series against Knicks saying, ooh, 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 no, they were more worried. We about have no those. chance to no, play the Knicks. Well, they're pros, of course. No, no, but, but I'm Milwaukee, saying, George, they beat Milwaukee. That's what they're I'm saying. One. Miami is good enough to beat them though. Well, they don't forget the freak side out. That was big. It gave them their well, whatever. They beat them. Yeah. Now, once again. In this series, there's Brunson. He killed. Well, Cleveland. he shot bad. That's you all. See what he shot yesterday? Yeah, but I mean, when you shoot bad, you can't win. Did you see what he shot? One for ten. One yeah, for 10. but you're, I knew that. But I, that it. came out. Everybody said it on the news. No, you're not. But I'm do saying, it. shoot bad, look bad, shoot good, look good. Yeah. Oh yeah. Well, that's, that's been forever. Yeah, that, that's what that's I'm saying. But so that's no. Either. That's but that's for any team in the NBA. Now, can the Knicks win if they can? They still won? No. Really? I mean, he's better than Knicks. You think they're going that fast? Oh, just win one game, you're saying? Well, they no, can, they, they could win two or three games. They could win one at Miami to bring it back, yeah. is what I'm saying. They could win one. They, okay. They're not beating them. All right. Denver, Phoenix. This is the one. Well, well, well tell me about uh, uh, the uh, center for Miami. Is he coming back at no, all? No, I don't believe so. He's no. A, no. Not no. coming back at no, all either? I think, no, he tore something big. Okay. Well, I'll take that back then. If, if he doesn't come back and play, there's no, a he, chance. No hero. I, I knew hero was out, but they don't. They Butler takes up for him. Now, Denver, Phoenix, 1-0. Home court. I always tell Al, in the old days, I thought you needed the best player. Then I thought you needed the second best player. Now I think you need a triumvirate. And with Porter Jr., I think in Murray and Jokic, they have it. I wasn't sure. Now, obviously, the other side with Durant well, they have three. and yeah. Booker, you want to throw either Chris eight Paul and, Paul, and yeah. or eight. Yeah. Eight and you got four. 
Yeah, they don't have any bench, Phoenix. No, I, don't, no. I don't think it means much. No, I really don't think no. it means much. You don't think they'll wear out then? No, okay, no. Okay, because uh, uh, what you call him, Chris Paul has a tendency to get hurt to further the playoffs. Yeah, playoff he does. that happens. That's true. You know what I mean? That's yeah. what I don't know. Um, like I said, if I were you, because I thought the time to take Phoenix was they were minus money. Now they're plus money. Yeah. Now, if they lose another in Denver, I, I'm Yeah, sorry. I didn't like Phoenix, so I'm not uh, yeah. taking I, I, no, I, I, I'm, I thought Denver would win. But, well, I'm looking but, right yeah. now. From what I saw, you know, you don't go by one game. You yeah, know that. I know, that's, from, that's the fool's from gold. From what of, I saw Saturday of the NBA, that's darn the fool's good. gold. There, there, there is. Yeah. Now, short bench for Phoenix. You alluded to that could be a problem. Uh, the one everyone's talking about. This one, even you know how women that don't watch football watch the Super Bowl. Occasionally, maybe an All Star game. Well, I think this Golden State. Laker thing is going to be similar. Yeah, that's that is that's the names. That's the LBJ. Name. And yeah, stuff. yeah. You know, when you got LeBron and Curry, are they Curry, the most all time fans? Yeah, oh yeah, they are on the way in today. Once again, I had to hit the channel. I had to change it quickly. Mad Dog and some other old fart, older than Methuselah. How much better Jerry West was than Steph? A di- different I, era, but you players. can only shoot the ball. So I mean. Now, you want to talk about long arms defense, I'll listen. Yeah, that's the side I'd say that. Yeah. And I would say that. But if you he's want a to thousand times better defender. But shooting the ball. No, he's, no, he's the best shooter I of mean, all time. But still, just think of the two was, and once again, you can't, uh, if the guy said it right, he said, if, if, if without the three, Kirk could shoot out there all day as a two-point two shot. Point. Yeah. You understand? No, no. That game has changed. It's, it's not even close to the same no, game. No, not in, no, in high school. And that's why I, pick, I take yeah. West over Steph. And I'm, and I'm the biggest Steph of all time. Yep. But he doesn't guard like West did. No, West, West, West guard. guard. But also, they were allowed to guard then. Yeah, that's true, to. too. Steph Curry's the greatest shooter by far of anybody ever. No, I mean, absolutely. Yeah. Now, the Lakers added about, what, about a month and a half before I'm, the end? I'm on the show. If you watch, put our old shows yeah, on. Yeah. I picked them to win the title. They're I won't right. get off it. I'll tell you, they've gotten some great play from Blake. Who's the lefty that just Russell. <laughs> Word. But, he, he, but he doesn't do like that all but the time. But I'm saying. They only these one time. One night I know. Against, I know. But they got uh, the other two guys. Sacramento. You're talking about two of the greatest players of all the time. The other guy, I watched closely the other night. He changes the entire oh, yeah, game. Yeah, we know that. From he, the can he in. play? Well, he play. That's the question. I mean, he smacks that ball off the bank board. And no, all he's that. different completely on both no. sides, and offense and defense. Like whatever he's healthy. He dominated Memphis. He's a dominating player. I mean, really. To the nth degree. Yeah. I mean, yeah. I mean he had know. Memphis to the point they were looking for him. Yeah, he's just a great driving player. Driving in. You can't look for him driving He's such in. a great player. No, absolutely. No, I'm a, now, Looney will have his hands full. But I'm going to say, I'm going to take my hat off to Looney Sunday. He plays all the games. 21 rebounds. <laughs> but he also, I like better. Many, they said he played all 82 games. I said right away. As soon as he said that. Yeah, he's got a, I got a fan. I got a fan hey, of Looney. How about this, too? Double figure O boards. Yes. When did you ever see that? When did you ever never. see? I've never, never. seen. No. Unbelievable. Uh, there's another story in Milwaukee's collapse. Uh, some strange doings there. Uh, Coach Budenholzer's brother was That's killed sad, during yeah. the week in uh-huh. auto. I'm sure that his heart was heavy. But there were some things that went on in that series, like taking Lopez out. There's under two seconds. Miami needs what amounts to a lob to the uh-huh. basket. And you take Lopez, who's your biggest man. Now, you want to put Freak back there. I'm okay, Lopez, on what the ball. What do you say? You say anything about that? You haven't read anything no, about it? No, I haven't okay. read it. Okay, okay. I mean, I'm sure... Those guys are being a little light on them because of okay. the circumstances. That would be my guess. Now, let's start right here. Major League Baseball. There's a couple of stories. There's one big one. It's the Pittsburgh Pirates. We'll talk about Tampa later. Let's talk about the Pirates. Just getting tremendous play from guys they didn't expect it from. And that, that is the, the ideal play. And number two, they're getting a really, really outstanding pitching. From, now, from, will they play the their baseball card? That's my question. We always I know use they that will. phrase. Yeah, I know they will. Yeah, there's no question about that. That happens, that happens every – that's just not Pittsburgh. That's every team. So you're and not expect. I mean, obviously they're not going to go 20 and 9. No, that means they're going 100 games. But what, <laughs> what are you looking for right now after seeing – they played a month. Um, well, I can't. I can't really – I'm saying 81-81. That's oh, what I'll say. Oh. That's Why are you an improvement then? Oh, but they have to be. They've won I mean, 20 games I mean, already. They were 68. What would they have to be there? Because you're good in math. Yeah. What would they have to be to, to get well, 81 wins? Well, 20 and 10, they played 30, so they need 130, so they would need 61 and 69. Yeah, and they could do that. Okay. Yeah. That makes sense. Yeah. Okay. Uh, playing Tampa this week, no significance other Nothing. than they're both red hot. No. That's all. Yeah, it doesn't mean anything uh, to me. The other story is kind of, we talked before we came in here. Baltimore Orioles, it's their That biggest, one doesn't surprise me. 
They're coming. Because yeah, they're, 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 they're coming last year. Yeah, yeah. No yeah the question. Pirates are a major surprise. Baltimore's Absolutely. not a major surprise. Yeah. yeah. I took all Baltimore over, but the number's heavy. It's not like Pittsburgh, 68. Gotcha. Baltimore's number's a little heavier. Yeah, and you just got to hope they keep playing. Yeah, like as you say, I like to start. Yeah, it's a marathon, guys. Yeah, it's not. You know, we could talk. I've talked to George on the show a million yep. times about yep. the NBA doesn't mean anything during the regular season, and 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 Major League Baseball, you want to get a good start. Yeah, yeah. But at any time in August, they could lose ten rows. twenty in a row. I mean, it's a long you know, year. They could lose ten in a row. It's a long year. Uh, Oakland, that pace, they're at five and twenty-one or six. Yeah, they're a, they're a minor league. No, it, it looks like they're killing time till they go to. They're Vegas. a minor league. Is that team. what they're doing now? Yeah. No, they play every day. I, I gotta say that. I follow them. They play every day. They still no, they have no pitching. They get beat late, huh? They have no pitching. They get beat late. Yeah, no pitching. Bullpen. No pitching. That's what it is. Yeah. No, I agree. I walked the same. Thing. Yeah. And we were talking about the Yankees. Before. That's one thing about major league sports. I mean, all sports. The people that say something, they play every day. That's what they do. They have a passion for the game. You mean play to win? Yes. Yeah. yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. You want to? You want to go broke quick? Win. Here's a line. They need it. <laughs> you want to go broke? Yeah. They play. NFL they football, just aren't good enough. Week 17, they go, oh, they got the Redskins, Redskins. Redskins. Yeah. Watch yourself. Yeah, it happens all the time. I've watched a million. Remember that one thing. Don't go, don't win a week left. They'll go, this, 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 and this have to happen. And they do. And they look, and you're like, okay, now they just have to win. <laughs> have and they, they don't win. twice. Yeah. <laughs> then they don't win or something. Yeah. No, I agree. Now, the Yankees. I'm serious. I know you're going to get, I've got to. Bring that training staff in. And I oh, go, you got to. I talk to him. I said, no, listen. Stan's hurt. <laughs> no, the whole team's every hurt. Year. <laughs> Judge is hurt for a little while. Two pitchers are out. Yeah. What are we doing Something's here? wrong. I know that. Are we stretching? Are we not stretching? Yeah, I don't or? know what they're doing. I have no idea. But I at least, at least do some serious contemplating what's going on. I agree. You know, with a $300 million payroll, there are no excuses. No, they always have it. No. You know who's finished his suspension midweek? Scherzer. It was going to be earlier, but they were rained out. Is he a cheater? Well, that day he was. Okay. He <laughs> said it was rosin and sweat. Well, maybe it was. I don't. I don't believe a word they say. I'm just guessing. Say when you get thrown out of the game. How about when Gaylor Perry threw the thing out in the sandpaper, flew behind him? He took the guy goes. I think you're out, Gaylor. I that was the best thing. Yeah. He did have something on his hand and glove. Something. That's the bottom line. Right, something. You know, we have a buddy, has the greatest line of all time. He says, Coach, he says, why don't they check him before they go out there? I'm the better than after, right? After they makes sense. It. I said, I don't know why that sounds so. What am I missing? Makes sense. <laughs> Does it make sense to yeah, you? Yeah, I don't know what the rules are. They'd be up mad and say, what are you checking me for? Okay. Hey, you how know, about so. this on the uh, length of the gauge? We know they're a half hour shorter. Yeah. This is this, that. Now, remember, they played only one month, but still one fifth. You know, but we're getting to one fifth, be, one fifth be 30 games. No four hour games. Guess how many last year? 19. Yeah, I would, th- I would have guessed that. So that I, I would have guessed that. Now, here's the news in the NFL. Only they can make picking the players. They used to have Pete Rousseau on a blackboard. I remember. Now, it's an event. They had a hundred and some thousand people. Wait, oh, it's bad enough. They were painted up and standing in the rain. I saw them. You need help, people. <laughs> you need them. help if you're out. But there. I'll tell you, cities are campaigning to get that draft Absolutely. now. Absolutely. You know, they know they're bringing bring millions, millions, into, millions. This, into the city. Yeah. Uh, so, you know, like I said, to be truthful, we need three years. That's the only way you know. Yeah. But, you know, yeah. looking on paper, it appears some did well, some did not. And then you made a good point the other day in the radio. Jackson signed that day, too. That was everything for them. Baltimore just hit the jackpot. Yes. That all these other people are drafting quarterbacks. Who might be good. Yeah, they know Jackson's good. I think a guy said the other day about draft picks. I said, I know Rodgers is a jackass, but I also know he can play quarterback. Oh, yeah. Your draft choice may, may or not play may no not play. be. I truth. know Rodgers can right. play. Right. You agree. That's why the Jets won him so badly. Yeah. They knew they had nothing. Think about it. This last year, they had... Uh, the second pick in the draft, and the draft of the quarterback, and now they've already given up on him. Yeah. Wow. You met, Albert, do you remember the day he went public and said, the wind was blowing? Yes. The wind. Albert, he was out of there the that team day. team hated him that day. Yeah. They, they wore signs for white, the backup. Yes. And that tells you all you need to know. Now, biggest news, obviously, Rogers there, but that had been going on for weeks. But the bottom line was, it happened. Now, the Rogers story is when he sat there forever. Will Lev is sitting there on the couch the entire time. Whoever told him he was a first-rounder didn't talk to us. <laughs> no, he didn't. <laughs> he would have st- saved his no, money, right? He, yep, he should not. Now, he did go early. He did go early day two. Yeah, you know, oh, right away. Second uh, pick. Hey, you know, let's, how about this one, though? 
Let's talk about this. Lose, does he lose a lot of money though for, uh, the first round or second round? I thought so. Slotted. They're thought slotted. so. Hey Al, here's one. Two running backs before any receiver. They're stupid. What are your thoughts on <laughs> I that? Said it. Bad idea. Bad idea. Runners they, they, and runners. They get the most care. I mean, the most most in the NFL right now. I, I looked it up. Six. They play six out of ten plays. <laughs> Why would you pl- draft a running back that plays half. six out of ten mm-hmm. plays? You're gonna. They all go. There's. They all play yeah. two or three running backs every game. How about Philly with all these Georgia guys? I'm, I'm, well, I'm rooting against them hey, because guy, everybody's, everybody has the everybody. The guy sent me a text here. Are you ready for this? And he says, there aren't many this many guys from Georgia and Pennsylvania since the Battle of Gettysburg. <laughs> uh, yeah. Six trades the first night, so doing the order, why not just throw your stuff into the wind? We tell our buddy at Every all mock the time. draft. Every because, mock draft had them wrong. There was not, there was not about, one close. How about six, draft, six trades, though? That's a lot. Yeah. Hey, the best thing I saw, I don't like Jerry Jones, but when they... Drafted little Deuce, uh-huh. and they had his dad call him, and then yeah, his dad cool. heard the pick in. I gotta say, that was I, pretty cool. That yeah, was. I have that to was pretty cool. And I know one thing: he's a good player. That too. boy can scoot. Yeah, he can play too. Can yes. he scoot over? Yeah, we know. If he was if he's six foot two, he would have been drafted higher. Now the Mr. Irrelevant, everybody makes a joke about. It. But here's what I know about Mr. Irrelevant: till the dude got hurt, Purdy, he was leading them to the Super Bowl. Yeah, yeah, he was a different. Did it look he, that he way a, to you? He was a different Mr. Irrelevant. Did it look that way to you? Yeah, he was pretty good. Okay. NCAA football. No, what's that? That's the portal opening again. <laughs> I got a buddy who calls it the porthole. I don't bother correcting him. I just know that the idea is right. Now, Colorado, spring game, day after, 23 leads. Something's going on there already. Well, he ran them out. <laughs> well, we did do that. But I mean, you know what's interesting? You can't I, run too many out now. I, 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 interesting. Oregon almost has the same amount. And no one's written anything about it. Well, See, it's, it's, but they don't run their mouth. Coach that's Prime. what it is. He brings on Coach a, Prime. But I think he wants that, though. Uh, well, you understand he's that? got He it. wants that attention. He's got it for me. He better hope he wins. He wants that attention Like badly. yesterday, he was lamenting the fact no HBCU. He wants that attention. That's funny. He's so sad that no he one He left him, didn't he? <laughs> you know you're reading my mind. If you liked it that much, Dion, don't go for the money. Yeah, right. Stay there and bring him out of the right. hole. yes. He's a phony. No, he brings it on himself. He does. Yeah. No, it's not Coach Dion. Remember Coach Sanders. Yeah, Coach That's Prime. That's Coach Prime. Yes. Don't forget that. Absolutely. Now, we agree. It's going to hurt high school on this trickle down. No, that should help D2. No, no doubt. So I guess there's going to be guys in Slippery Rock in Indiana mm-hmm. that we never dreamed. Yes, and that's uh, that's always going to happen now because kids are looking for a place. They don't all have places to go. What did they give us? 43% did That's the number that came out. That's, 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 that's Four out of every ten kids don't, don't get a chance yeah, to go that's, that's someplace. Yeah. Now. Memphis with a 40-point romp. They get embarrassed and run out of the league. They did all this talking, but yet at the end when they have to talk, they're paying $25,000 fine. <laughs> but here was the best one about them. I'm watching them the other night. <laughs> it's 164. Now, it, remember, I didn't say 98, 97. Right. It's 164, and what are they doing? I told you. Playing for the last shot. <laughs> oh, now, God. don't you think you might want to shoot twice? 30 times. Try to get as many shots up as you can. <laughs> Thank yeah. you. Thank you. Unbelievable. Uh, last minute, we'll leave on this. Passing of a legend in the Western PA area right across the border. Dick Road. A lot of kids are too young. They yeah, know they him as yeah, the they know him, yeah. voice of the pit basketball. But 48 points in a game back in the day, back before It's North trade. Carolina, yeah. Player of the year. But only, two, only player in the history of, of college. That's in the basketball and the baseball Hall of Fame. Only one. Yeah. Nobody else. That's, yeah, how, good, not, that's, yeah. that's how good he was. He was one of the great athletes. Then they said, well, we want you to play baseball. I'll give it a try. He started right away. No minor leagues. Never played in the minor leagues. No. Yeah. Two World Series. He beat the Yankees twice. Uh-huh. He beat them once in Pittsburgh. Then he beat them once in St. Louis. Yeah, he's, he's, everything about him is Reek's class. Yeah. yeah. I only met him once. Couldn't have been any nicer. Yeah, I never met him, but yep. I, I, I know everybody who has. his grandson played for Franklin. Right. Was hey, Steph is cementing his legacy. Oh, yeah. He's one of the greats of all time. Agree? Agree. Thanks again for watching Bottom Line Sports Talk. We'll see you next week.